Recent seismic activity surrounding Thailand has heightened concerns with neighboring countries to the north, east, west, and south are experiencing significant tremors. The Thai Meteorological Department reported several notable earthquakes on July 3, 2025, at 7:40 a.m. local time. A 4.9 magnitude quake struck the Mandalay region in Myanmar, located about 314 kilometers northwest of Bang Mapa, Me Hong Son. Just minutes later, a 4. 5 magnitude earthquake hit northern Sumatra, Indonesia, about 490 kilometers southwest of Phuket. Both of these quakes, however, had no noticeable effect in Thailand. From June 24 to July 3, 2025, the Nicobar Islands in India recorded over 100 earthquakes ranging from 3.4 to 4.9 in magnitude. While the tremors were moderate, they did not affect Thailand. On July 2, another 4.3 magnitude earthquake occurred in Vietnam, located about 328 kilometers southeast of Ubon Ratchathani, Thailand, though again no tremors were reported in the country. This increased seismic activity surrounding Thailand serves as a reminder of volatile nature of the region, with tremors coming from all directions. The Earthquake Watch Division continues to closely monitor the situation, assuring the public that there's no immediate danger to Thailand. However, authorities are advising citizens to remain vigilant and stay updated on the latest developments. Meanwhile, Japan is grappling with its own seismic concerns. The Thai consulate in Fukuoka has issued a warning for Thai nationals in Japan to stay alert following 1,000 earthquakes in the Tokara Islands, locating southwest of the country. The most recent tremor was a 5.5 magnitude quake, prompting Japanese authorities to recommend the voluntary evacuation of residents from Kasuseki Island, which has only 89 people, starting June 4, while no tsunami warnings have been issued. Thai nationals in the region are urged to follow updates closely. Japan, situated in the Pacific's ring of fire, is no stranger to the seismic activity. The Nankai Trough, an underwater fault line along Japan's Pacific coast is a high-risk area of potentially catastrophic earthquake and tsunami. The Japanese government has updated its disaster response plans aiming to reduce casualties by up to 80% in the event of a major quake. The ongoing seismic activity has stirred public concerns, especially in the light of predictions linked to the manga The Future I Saw by Ryo Tatsuki. Originally published in 1999, the manga depicted a major earthquake and tsunami that occurred in March 2011. The 2021 re-release included a new prediction of a massive earthquake and tsunami on July 5, 2025, which some believe could affect Japan's southwestern coast. These rumors have already begun impacting Japan's tourism industry, particularly in Hong Kong where arrivals dropped by 11% in May. Greater Bay Airlines, for example, suspended flights to Japan, canceling its service to Tokushima starting in September due to low demand. While rumors have affected travel, discounts and earthquake insurance have helped some maintain their plans. The Thai consulate in Fukuoka and the Thai meteorological department continue to monitor the situation in both Thailand and Japan, urging citizens to stay informed and remain vigilant as seismic activity continues to affect the region. Tamarin Somha, The Nation